Hello and welcome back to Hardware Info. In this video, I will show you how to fix your Wi-Fi not working on Huawei Mate Pad 12X. Let's begin. Fixing the Wi-Fi is actually surprisingly not as simple as it seems because there are two things that could be not working properly either it's a your tablet or b it's a router for the purpose of me recording video about the tablet not the router i will start with the tablet in order to troubleshoot and fix most of the issues you probably just want to reboot your wi-fi and you can do that by expanding the control center from the top bottom like this uh, and you want to swipe from the top to the bottom from the upper right corner because if you will try to do it from other corners you will just go and end up with your notifications so let's scroll and expand our control center and let's press and hold on to the wi-fi icon and then we can go into settings and congratulations you can now see the wi-fi settings alternatively you could go and simply enter uh, through the, uh, to the, these settings through the settings and now we just click Wi-Fi here and you can see the exact same thing. Now we can disable the Wi-Fi and you want to give it a few moments. It doesn't really matter how much. I think about a few seconds should do be enough and you want to enable it once again. This is very quick, turn off, turn on again and it could help you, it could fix a lot of issues but usually it's actually, well, it won't do nothing. However, what will do something is actually unpairing and repairing your network. You can do that by going into network that you're already connected to, and here you have this beautiful forget button, and all you want to do is simply click it. And now your tablet will behave like it never really saw that uh, that network in its life. It will just don't recognize that guy. And you will notice that this is indeed true because now we have to input our password as usual. So let's input the password. If you actually don't know where your password is, usually it is located as some sort of sticker um, below the router or even next to it. Alternatively, you could ask a friend or a coworker, roommate or family member to show you the QR code that I just showed you and you can scan it and automatically connect to that network. And after you have done that, and if you click connect, and if the password is correct, you should be able to just connect to your network. And technically we did almost everything we could. Also there is one last result option for our tablet, and it is to restart it. And you can do that by pressing and holding power button. Now note that by default when you start pressing and holding it, you will see the AI companion. You just want to ignore the guy, we don't really care about him. And after we keep pressing, we should see the uh, power screen and we can just hit restart twice in order to restart our tablet. And whenever it restarts, it will restart every single thing on it, including the Wi-Fi chips, Wi-Fi systems and everything related to it. And at this point, we have basically did everything we could to fix any kinds of issues with Wi-Fi on our tablet. But the truth is that usually it's not our tablet that's fault, instead it's the router. Now you probably want to get up and just go to your router and unfortunately I can't really show you this only because there are many different routers out there but generally speaking you just want to unplug it from electricity you want to leave it like that for a couple of minutes and then you want to plug it once again and after a few more minutes it should automatically uh, reboot itself and connect to it's not working again however even if um, even after the rebooting it's still not working then there is a very high chance that your internet provider is screwed up maybe they have some problems on servers maybe they ran out of money it's pretty hard to tell but you can always check some different sites and uh, that show you certain services and they show you if they are down or not Mm, I don't f I don't remember the name, but I think one of their sites is, uh, is downdetector.com. Of course, it's not sponsored, uh, but it's a very nice site for checking if certain internet providers are actually providing their services that you're paying them for. And if they're not, you can always call them. You can always call them or contact the support and ask them, hey man, what's going on? I am paying for this and yet I have no Wi-Fi whatsoever. Though know that you probably want to leave it as the last option and before that you can try to do everything I just showed you in this video on the tablet. Then you want to reboot your router and only then you want to contact the internet provider. 
provider itself. And that's about it. If you found this video useful, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching. See you next time. Thank you.